Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Colin McGraw here. Uh, today I am unboxing and showcasing the Gel Resolution 9 Asics shoes. So these are good shoes, good shoes guys. First impressions, good clean colors, you know, feels quite stable, um, but it doesn't feel too plasticky or rough like some other shoes. Um, to give you an idea, the reason I brought my notepad is I wrote down the ones I was comparing it to and I always forget the names. I was comparing the Gel Resolution 9, so this is like a baseline shoe. So it's supposed to be, you know, known for much more stability. My ego got in the way a little bit because I was looking at the Solution, what was it? Solution Swift FF, which is known more for speed. And when I tried that one on, just know that shoe is very narrow and it was really tight. It felt like my shoe, my feet were suffocating. It wasn't a good fit for me. I also compared it with the Court FF Novak, which is kind of the best of both worlds, both baseline, stability, and speed. I didn't like that one as much. It felt a little too plasticky, a little too, I don't know, just didn't feel as comfortable on my shoe, but it was $40 more. That shoe went for $180, um, $180. And so I thought it'd be much better, but just didn't feel right. This is a really good shoe. Um, feels really right at my foot, $140. Um, and I quite like them. So I'm gonna try them on here. I'm also gonna compare this to two other shoes just so you know what the sizing is. So to give you an idea, um, I'm like a 10 and a half and 11. It's always just varies based on the brand for Asics, 10 and a half, 10 and a half here. Um, if we're looking at a Reebok shoe, I also have, this is 11 and I have an on running shoe and this is an 11. So I wouldn't say this is small cause this still feels quite good on my feet and that I have a little bit of room for the toe. I would just say if there's normally two sizes that you have when you're going to buy shoes, maybe go towards the smaller one for the Asics Gel Resolution 9. Let's try these bad boys on. thing I'll say about this shoe, let, let me go test it on the court. I'll show that here in a second. The only thing I'll say is I have a feeling that this won't last as long as maybe the Novak shoe, that extra $40 shoe. Um, so we'll see about that. That's just going to be a test in the long run. Um, but otherwise I'm really excited about these and let's get it going. I'm already late. I got to go to hit the courts, but, um, here we go. 